Today we're gonna to be showing you how to draw a monster truck. So grab yourself a sheet of paper, a pencil, and let's get started. So our truck's gonna be horizontal in direction. And what we're gonna to wanna to start to do is draw the, the bed of the truck. So we're gonna draw a rectangular shape like this. And if you have some rulers and some circle templates, you may wanna go grab those hit pause and go grab those. Um, so over here, this is gonna be the front of our truck. And our front of our truck's gonna be a little shorter than the back of our truck. And what we're gonna do is on the lower side, it's gonna be flat. The top side here, we're gonna come over like this, but then we're gonna hold it, hold that line like this, and then we're gonna slope it down. And I'm kind of radiusing and making my corners uh, rounded. The next step, we're gonna draw two wheels. So if you have a circle guide, I would go grab that. But if you don't, try to freehand it. And what the thought process here is this is the bed of the truck. So this distance here, we're gonna start our wheel a little bit lower, somewhere around here. And we're gonna have our wheel uh, not extend too far past the back of our truck, but on the front of our truck, because we're gonna have, we're gonna put a bumper here, we can have our wheel kind of stick out here a bit. So this is this height here, we want our wheel to be a little bit taller than this height here. So we'll just draw kind of an imaginary line down here as so, and then we'll draw one wheel over here like that, and then another one over here like that under the truck we're going to draw a rectangular shape like this like that and then we're going to come up not halfway from that shape a little bit back here so one quarter of the way over and then we're going to draw kind of a curved shape like this this is going to be the, the front window side the side window but of the front of the truck i'm going to have this go straight across and then this area here just in front of that we're going to have the front of the window so we're going to stop about here and then we're going to have that front window kind of angled like that and then this door sill coming coming down okay for the next step let's frame our window so we'll come here we'll draw a line that mirrors what we just drew, but inside and a little bit smaller like that. And then we're gonna draw the back shapes over here, like the roll bars. And we're just gonna put like, kind of like a double stack here. And then we'll draw the bumpers. So from this area here, it's our little rail to kind of step on here. We will draw a line up like this. And then right from this lower section here, we're gonna draw fenders for our, for our wheels. So we're gonna come about halfway in this rectangular shape here. So about halfway up like that and about halfway up over here. Okay, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna come down and we're gonna go to this spot here. So we're gonna do a little bit of a curve like that over here we'll curve this like this and we'll stop right about here because this is where our back bumper is going to be like that all right and then we'll draw our bumper thickness come over and then we'll match the fender flare like this and then we'll come all the way down to this shape here and we'll do the same over here on this side so we will come up and over and then down we'll stop short we won't go all the way to the bottom we'll stop just short here do our front bumper like that and then we'll match the same shape like we did in the rear fender like that now, before we go to the next step, let's draw the inner part of the, the wheel, the tire. So this will be the rim. So we'll draw, try to get this as centered 
you know, as, as best of in the center as possible for both these wheels. And you want to try to draw kind of the same, the same shape there, something a little smaller there. There we go. Okay, next step. Let's draw another box down here. So this is going to kind of come off and extend off of that door somewhere around here. And then like that, so we'll draw like a little box over here. Don't go too low, you don't wanna to go too low. Like that, we'll draw a little air scoop for the front of the truck. Grab all that air, kind of rushing in, giving us extra horsepower. Then we'll draw a little fender flare up here. And then the roll bar will come from, kind of like in the middle here, will come up and over. So we're gonna go up like this and then over. And then we'll do the same thickness that of these two. Just do one like this. All right, now we're gonna do some inner inner wheel well shapes in there. Same on this side. And then for our tires, um, what we wanna do is give them some dimension. So I'm just gonna darken this, you know, the front side of this rear tire and the back side of this front tire. And what we're gonna do is almost like the wheel is just shifting back. So we're gonna match this shape here and we're gonna kind of draw like another, another shape like this. So it's almost like it's a little bit bigger of a circle. So again, if you wanna grab your circle template, um, I would recommend doing that. And on, and on this side, we're gonna draw another circle like this with some thickness like that. And we'll do the same on the inside of the wheels as well. So because this back piece here shifted to the left, we're gonna shift the circle here to the left. So we're gonna take, take the circle. And if you, if you imaginary draw it here, you're just gonna see this side of the circle over there. Same thing here, we move that circle over in to the right direction. So if we took this circle and we drew an imaginary circle here, you're only gonna see it where the rim is over here. All right, just like that. And now let's add some tail lights. So we're gonna do a rear tail light. We're gonna do a front headlight like that. We'll do a side mirror and then we'll do some suspension now. So you could draw kind of like similar to these stacks here. Let's draw a couple suspension shapes over here and we'll do another couple over here like that. And then we're gonna connect it to this box in the center. So we'll draw a little shape here and then we'll draw a couple lines coming in there and a couple extending to the front like that and if you want you can draw another smaller circle in here with some like rivet kind of bolt-on lugs and over here we'll draw a smaller shape there with some bolt-on lugs like that. And there you have it. There's our monster truck. So I'm gonna grab my Sharpie pen and we're gonna kind of fill this in now. So and don't forget if you have a, a marker that has, that doesn't dry really quickly, you may smudge it, so just be careful on how you, um, you know, where you place your hand, your drawing hand on the page, because you might kind of smear some of the lines, and we don't want to kind of ruin our, ruin our drawing. 
Now for the tires, I like my tires to be a little rugged. So I'm just gonna draw these like little bumps. Like that, and then I'm just gonna add a little bit of dirt that this guy's kind of sitting on some dirt. And there you go, there's our monster truck. If you really like this tutorial, check out our How to Draw Stuff sketchbook. Inside, we have 90 really cool and fun things to draw. Each one has a simple step-by-step -step process that allows you to follow along and draw what you see right inside the sketchbook. It's really cool. You got to get yourself a copy.